The trauma will live with me forever. The images, smell and sound of the mosque on that day haunt me. Emotional victim impact statements being made today by survivors and families of the victims of the New Zealand mosque shootings as the sentencing hearing begins. I will have permanent disabilities and pain as a result of these injuries. However, I'm a strong, stubborn, stubborn Turkish man who has been brought up to battle long. The 29-year-old Australian national sat emotionless during the hearing. He has pleaded guilty to 51 murders, 40 attempted murders, and one charge of committing a terrorist act during the shooting rampage. It happened in Christchurch during Friday prayer on March 15th of last year. You terrorized the whole New Zealand and said in the whole world, you killed your own humanity, and I don't think the world will forgive you. My heart is yearning for restoration of justice to the victims of the heinous massacre and the call for the reinstatement of the death penalty for brutal, conscienceless crimes. It is a fact that justice should be a balance where the seriousness of the crime should be balanced by the consequences. The white supremacist could be the first person in New Zealand to receive a sentence of life in prison with no possibility of a parole. He will be sentenced later this week. Melanie Ng, City News.